Well, today, um, the Wichita Sedgwick County Continuum of Care is conducting a homeless count and services event for the community for people who are experiencing homelessness. The uh, purpose of, for the event is really twofold. First off, to be able to provide a snapshot of the homelessness in our community right now. Um, it's conducted each year at the end of January. Um, it's a snapshot of how many individuals are experiencing homelessness uh, to be able to let um, the community know, uh, or to be able to see exactly um, how many are experiencing it and also maybe some of the causes that have led to that. These individuals um, then are, after they're being interviewed and found out, um, you know, maybe how long they've been experiencing homelessness, um, maybe some of the factors that have led to that, um, are then able to um, visit various exhibits that are in um, the expo hall here. Um, we have various organizations that have um, come together um, to, to, to let individuals know uh, what kinds of services are available throughout the year. Um, we also have some groups that are providing um, immediate um, items like um, gloves and um, hygiene products that they can use immediately, but really, more importantly, uh, organizations that can provide um, ongoing um, assistance um, and um, services, whether it be in healthcare, um, jobs, uh, job training, education, um, these groups are here, as well as a whole group of services that are directed toward individuals that are veterans that are experiencing homelessness. So a focused effort in that area as well. So as individuals can go through the day, they're able to uh, find out maybe what services are available that they didn't know about, um, be able to get some health screenings, um, a few things like haircuts and a few things like that that they can have some immediate help, but really long term to be able to get connected uh, for to be able to help their current situation. Um, the whole idea is individuals are experience homelessness for various reasons. And so there's going to be a lot of different um, opportunities to, to look at what can people do to help and they can receive that help and be able to get some hope um, for their lives and be able to go on from there.